hello guys welcome back to my channel the cinnamon and today in this video i am going to show you how to make cupcakes using milk yes you heard it right i'm just going to use milk here and no other substance like condensed milk or curd or anything at all so let's get started we're going to need a bowl and then we are going to add milk is one cup milk and I am using a mold milk here and yes it is evaporated milk evaporated milk is a form of milk which is being cooked and the water content in the milk has been reduced so that is evaporated milk I have taken one cup of milk here then I have added one fourth cup of oil and two teaspoons of vanilla six tablespoons of granulated sugar and then we whisk it vigorously and this is the substitute you can use for evaporated milk if you don't find evaporated milk use the amul milk here and then i'm going to add one and a half cup of all-purpose flour and in that i'm going to add half a teaspoon of baking powder and one and a quarter teaspoon of baking soda and we put it together then we mix it and make a thin batter we are going to make the consistency of the batter thinner than the cakes batter cakes batter is quite thick and this one is much more thinner and then I am going to add 50 ml of butter in this this is melted butter we are going to add this Gonna give it a very good mix and now I'm going to pour the mixture into my molds you're gonna have to take one third cup of measurement I have taken a one third cup measurement here I filled it till the top and then poured it in the molds and we are going to bake it at 180 degrees Celsius for 15 minutes After 15 minutes, our cup cupcakes are finally done. They are perfectly cooked and we are going to let them cool for about an hour. And this is my second batch of cupcakes and this has also been cooled and now we are going to frost them. For that, you are going to need two colors that is green and pink and the white green here. I have taken these colors and colored my whipped cream and already filled it in the bag now we are going to start piping so this is the open star tip I have taken here which is the small one so we are going to make two swirls and then small star like figures here just like that just the way how I am showing you here and then we are going to make the ruffle Decorate these cupcakes, just follow the instructions I've shown in the video. For this decoration, you guys gonna have to use buttercream here. I have used buttercream for this decoration because if we try and do this with regular whipped cream, that is non-dairy whipped cream, the color which we are looking for is never going to appear. 
so it will be a disappointment if you try and do it with regular cream so definitely use buttercream here For this decoration guys, I am using regular white buttercream and these are some previously made roses which I have made on a parchment paper and then fr froze them because freezing the buttercream is really nice, it's a nice technique because working with frozen buttercream is much more easier than working with a regular consistency buttercream. This is the piece I have used to make these tiny roses and now I am making the leaves with these roses here. If you guys are able to work with buttercream on the spot, feel free to do that. This is another way you can decorate the cupcake. You just have to make a space in the middle of the cupcake. Then fill it with some sprinklers or gems or any other filling you like. Here I have used some rainbow sprinklers to fill the gap here. And we fill it up till the top. And then, and then place the piece of cupcake on top of it just like that then we make some simple swirls on it and we sprinkle some more colorful sprinklers to this yes the simplest cupcake decoration is ready this is the easiest way. There is one more way is that you take the white piece and keep a red rose in the middle of it and then top it with some green leaves. And this looks amazing, simply amazing. And now I'm going to show you how our cupcakes look from the inside. They're extremely moist, soft and really tasty. Now as you see how beautiful the interior of the cupcake is. It is so moist and quite dense. Bahut zada fluffy nahi hai. I mean, it's not too much airy. It is dense, soft, and really tasty. So, do make this recipe at your home. And do let me know in the comment section whether you like it or not. Thank you very much for watching this video.